Professor Lin, welcome to CGTN. It's my pleasure. When people think of investment, Chinese investment in Africa, they immediately think of the massive infrastructure projects undertaken by China's state-owned enterprises, building roads, highways, bridges, and ports in Africa. But in fact, the data tell us more than 70% of Chinese companies investing in the continent are now private firms. Professor, what has been the draw for those private companies, and uh, how do they compare to their state-owned peers? I think certainly it represents the economic opportunity for the private sectors. But at the same time, investment and the trade, just like trade, is always win-win. Mm. It's not only benefit Chinese companies, but also benefit job generations in Africa to transform African competitive advantages into producing goods that they can export to the global markets or to compete in their domestic markets with imported goods. And so they will generate more job more opportunity for the African development. The report on uh, Chinese investment in Africa, which was released, has also listed obstacles to Chinese investment in Africa. We're talking about political instability. We're talking about local laws and regulations, um, also a lack of talent and those cultural differences. How do you suggest we tackle these issues? For the political instability, First, not all the African countries encounter those kind of problems. There's only a few countries. You need to understand there are 54 countries in Africa. And, uh, you know, country with political instability is just a bundle. So the majority of African countries actually are stable. And the second is certainly they have different legal systems. So we need to understand their culture, their legal system, in order to do our business there. But certainly, we can also improve by you know, the bilateral arrangement you know, to you know, voice our concern, and they can also you know, motivate, uh, modify their business environment and so on to make investment in Africa more investment friendly.